my sunshines and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great day. It is the end of the night here and I found myself with a rare like hour to hour and a half to myself. I am trying to get up to date with videos and actually have some pre-filmed. Uh, I'm definitely a fly by the seat of my pants type of girl, but I'm trying to be a little more organized, turning over a new leaf. We'll see how that works. So I have all my jewelry off. My makeup is pretty much gone for the day, but it doesn't matter because I'm going to be talking to you about rocks box. But before we open this, I wanted to answer a question that's been really, really popular in the comment section of my videos lately. And that is how I organize my jewelry. I get this question quite often. My big, huge statement necklaces, I have hooks in my closet, like organizing hooks that I got from Target. And I just hook those on there and let them hang. But I do have a vanity with three drawers on one side and that is dedicated to my jewelry. It's the side facing my closet. And so I get these from TJ Maxx. They're $7.99. I actually just bought a couple of more. They're $7.99. This particular trip, I got two grays and a white. I personally do not care what color they are. I have pink, I have rose gold, I have regular gold. It doesn't really matter. And they come in different configurations. Like this one's got the two bigger slots and then six smaller slots. There's some that have spaces for rings and where this has six medium slots, there's one that has nine smaller boxes so you can get earrings in. This is the configuration that I like though. You can get them in like sets where there'll be a couple of different style boxes in each set, but this is the one I like and they're $7.99. And here's what I do. I open up a drawer. My drawers are long enough where I can put two of these in a drawer and then I stick a third one on top. So when I'm looking for something, I can just kind of grab this one, look over here and decide what I want to wear. And then my drawers are sort of organized by like gold dainty jewelry. Cause remember all of my statements, jewelry is in my closet. So gold dainty jewelry and earrings and bracelets, silver dainty jewelry and bracelets. And then the bottom one, sort of a mix mash of like charms and different things like that. So I hope that answers your question. You can sometimes only find one of these. Sometimes you won't find them. Sometimes uh, this trip I found three. So you just kind of have to search every time you're in TJ Maxx, Marshalls, or Home Goods. But that is what I use. I hope that answered that question. Let's talk about Roxbox today. So Roxbox is a monthly jewelry subscription. It is $21 a month. That's your styling fee. You get sent three designer pieces of jewelry. Two of them will be from your wish list, which you fill out this huge wish list of pages and pages of jewelry that you like. And then your stylist will pick a third piece that she thinks you will like. Then they send you an email. They say, hey, these are the pieces that we've pulled for you. You have 24 hours to decide if you like those pieces or if you want to switch out one, two, or three pieces in this collection. And then once you've either told them what you wanted to swap out, you get some choices, or you've said you're your set is perfect, go ahead and send it. They send your box within 24 hours. So super, super easy. Then you can pick what you want to keep from the box and pay the prices. Each thing is priced individually, but you can use your $21 credit for, or your styling fee toward your first piece of jewelry. But what's great is you've already paid the $21 for the month. So if I send this back, I can actually get another box by next week and it's all in the same $21 for the month. So you can get three or four boxes in the same month, which I think is totally great. You do fill out a really easy styling kind of profile. Do you like gold jewelry, silver jewelry, hoop earrings, statement necklaces, that kind of thing, but it takes like five minutes probably. I also have a code for you with a link that I'm going to link below so you can get your very first rocks box totally free. And what's best about it is you actually get to keep the $21 styling fee, even though you didn't pay for anything, you get to keep that $21 styling fee toward your first piece of jewelry. So that is amazing. I'll link that below, but let's go ahead and see what's inside. I've actually had this box for a couple of weeks now. I just haven't had time to unbox it. So this is what it looks like. I just love the packaging. When you, if you see a piece that you don't really like, cause sometimes it's hard to tell on the computer if you're gonna like something or not, you just put what you don't like back in here. There's actually a mailing label back in here. So you stick your label back on here. This opens in a way that you can reseal it and send it back totally free. So you're not paying to send anything back either. You get a little card from your stylist that tells the pieces that I am getting. And then it looks like this, it just says XOXO. And then inside are three little drawstring bags. 
with my jewelry inside. Okay, so let's see what's in the first one. Like I said, I don't remember. It's been a little while. Oh, I do remember this one. Okay, I have a bracelet very similar to this. This is gorgeous. This is has their semi-precious stones in it. It's 14 karat gold and silver plated, one of a kind hand set gemstones. This is by their Dusk line. Is that not stunning? It's just beautiful. That's gorgeous. Like I said, I do have the bracelet that has some of the same stones in it. This is called the Siren Pendant by Dusk and it's $59. And the little chain is adjustable, it's gold. So you can make it longer, but that's really pretty. I really like that. Okay. Ooh. I'm gonna fill up these next three little jewelry containers, right? <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, then the next thing in here is by Perry Street. I couldn't tell these online and I went back and forth about putting them on my wish list, but I decided to keep them. These are by Perry Street. They're the Marina Square Studs in a light blue opal. They are really pretty and they're $34. I think the earrings I have on today are from Rocks Bucks. They're like a pretty amethyst. They're really pretty. Those are pretty too. Hmm. I don't know, I'm not sure about these or not. I'm gonna have to think about those. I do love a good opal, but I like a classic sort of white opal. And I think that's what I thought this was, even though it, it does say light blue opal, that's my fault. I do like them, I just don't know if I want them. And then the third thing is by Slate, it is the Gia Cuff in gold for $38. And I really do like this. I'm sorry, I have like sticky lip gloss on and for some reason it's getting stuck in my hair, okay. If I can get this on, yeah. So it does, it's easy to adjust and get on and off. And that's what it looks like. Really pretty, interesting. I think you could definitely layer that with other things. I really like that a lot. I've kind of been into like daintier cuffs lately and I like that one. So again, that was the Slate Gia Cuff in gold for $38. Now, if you buy one piece in your set, you do get the $21 credit. If you buy all three pieces in your set, you get an additional $10 off, which is a great incentive. My total for this would be $131. And if I bought all three, it would take it down to 121. I do really think this is beautiful. And I think I'm gonna keep this little necklace and then I'm not sure that I'm gonna keep the earrings. I don't really need them. I think they're really pretty, but I, I'm not sure I'm gonna keep them. And then I'm kind of debating on the cuff. I do really like it though. I have a little bit of credit, so I could, I think I could get the cuff for free. So let me know what you think of that. So that's my rocks box. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new, my name is Christy and welcome. I'm incredibly happy to have you. Please comment below where you're from so I can welcome you personally in the comments. To all my tried and true subscribers, thank you for being here and taking time out of your day to spend with me. I truly, truly, truly am thankful to each and every one of you. I'll see you for my next video. Bye-bye.